Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Lumen Moon Tarot. So everybody I am here doing just a random collective reading okay. Um, this reading for sure is not going to be for everyone okay. So just take what does resonate and toss out what doesn't. Don't try to force this one into your world okay. Um, yeah, this is a collective reading, by the way, and I know it's not going to be for all of you, so. And um, thank you to everyone for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares. Collective, thank you so much for, uh, like, the smiley faces and emojis, the kindness that you guys give me, um, the really awesome compliments, and just you guys make me feel wonderful and it helps keep me going throughout the day we're raising each other's vibes okay um so thank you so much for everything that you do that helps me keep going and it helps the channel keep growing right and that's what it's all about you know is us growing for each other anyway um <laughs> What I'm seeing here, I, I don't know if you guys have figured it out. Have you figured it out by looking at the pictures? I feel like there's, this is, this stands for a promiscuous feminine energy, okay? Someone is very promiscuous here. Um, and they're getting some jaw-dropping news, okay? Like, this is a, this is a oh-no kind of moment, all right? Jaw-dropping. And it's stressing this karmic out. This is the kar a karmic feminine who's been promiscuous. Now, if you notice, this is the feminine's energy, the karmic's energy. Sorry, the feminine, this feminine karmic, right? And here's the masculine. What do you see? They're both itching. There's both, their hands are both in the same place in the groin area, right? Um, and this person, this masculine doesn't have anything to say. They're just, they're so steaming mad right now. <laughs> I mean, this is, this can be boredom too, but in this case, this is being so angry that, I, I don't know. I think they're going to lose it. I think the karmic is upset, but this is kind of a guilty feeling too. Like, oh my gosh, this can't be happening. This can't be happening. Yeah, it's happening. Both of these people have gotten an STD. Both of them. This karmic and the masculine both have some kind of STD. Then I've got this guy. What does that look like to you? Warts or some kind of something all over. Okay, um, yeah, oh, <laughs> and somebody's steaming mad. I'm telling you, this, this masculine is so angry because I, I feel like um, the karmic has, got, has given this person an STD. They're absolutely, both of them are completely stunned, jaw-dropping news, uncomfortable, itching, um, angry, this masculine is angry, screaming, raging, on the phone, like, is there anything we can do to make it better? Oh my gosh, there's not. There's no cure for, I don't know what this is. There's no cure for this. And there's a lot of masculines out there, a lot of karmics, um, karmic relationships that are going through this because this is a giant collective energy. Okay, um, so yeah, something, and this is something that there's no cure for, and it's gross. <laughs> it's gross, and there's no cure for it. Wow, yeah, they're trying to fight over who gave who what. But I feel like, um, I feel like this, the karmic is more on the defense, and this masculine is like, you give me the truth now. Yeah, guys, wow. That's pretty crazy. Let's pull the flash deck.
let's see what's going on in the karmic situation because uh, somebody has an STD. And I'm, 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 this has to, like, this karmic is like, oh, no, no, this has to be a mistake. This can't be right. This can't be right. This can't be right. You know what I mean? And they're grossed out by it. Yeah, this, the masculine is very upset. Very upset. Can't find any, any cure. They're not going to be able to find a cure. This is something that's incurable. Could be something like herpes, you know, and it spreads. It spreads. Yeah, guys. I'm telling you, this the karmic situation here. Okay, so you guys know once I bring my flash deck out, just about anything can. It's a, it's a very karmic deck. All right, what can you show me? Yeah, somebody lied in this situation. It's all being brought into the light. Somebody lied, then their story is full of freaking holes. And I feel like it's this karmic individual because it's their promiscuity that has given this, that's, that contracted the STD in the first place. They gave it to this masculine. And they are like bug-eyed, angry, freaked out about it. Freaked completely. They are irate, screaming at this karmic. Look, the karmic's getting headaches, crying because of it. Yeah. They're fighting over who gave who what, and, and the karmic story is a lie. I feel like... Um, yeah, I feel like this is this is maybe the fight could be being said around the children, um, or there you know th there's a chance that there's a child that's not even this person's child. But I'm just I'm just seeing if there's children around, they're fighting around the kids. The kids are finding this out too, because there could be a lot of screaming going on here, screaming, fighting bickering back and forth i mean it's a very tense um kind of a scary moment especially for the kids because they don't th th that little they don't understand what this is you know looking up medical stuff the kids i feel are scared they don't understand because the fighting is going on in front of them I feel like your masculine is planning with a friend. I love these two. They could even be brothers. They could be talking to a brother about it or somebody else trying. That was already out. Yeah, about this feminine energy. I feel like it's the karmic. Yeah, dude, I feel like nothing can really be done about this. I really, especially with the frowny face on this little bumpy frog. Oh, yeah, nothing can be done about this. I feel like their friend, whoever it is, is telling them to have a new start. Cut this out. Get rid of this. Yeah, they need to, they need to cut it out. Yeah, it's like it's starting to look like a crime scene now. I feel like that's what their friend is telling them. It's starting to look like a crime scene now, man. You know, and they already dread it. They already dread it. Yeah, that's, you know, we've been getting that in tarot land. Um... Okay, so this is this is actually a divine feminine card here. This this cat is a divine feminine here, right here. 
I feel like this person just constantly thinks about how they could have colored a beautiful life with you, okay, with the Divine Feminine. Um, this could be a twin flame here that we're talking about. This could be a Divine Masculine that went and got them. I mean, this is part of their karma, I guess. Pretty sad karma. Yeah. The light is being shed on everything, and it's turned into a very emotional moment for your for your masculine. They're seeing everything very clearly now, very, very clearly, um, that they should have cut this out a long time ago before it got this bad. Um, very emotional, a lot of crying here, but they're, they may be trying to hide it. The karmic is starting to freak out, wig out a little bit. One minute they may be nice and calm. The next minute they're screaming, snapping. Um, this is maybe triggering some kind of mental issue here. This is triggering something for this karmic. Some kind of mental or chemical imbalance thing or something. But they're going off too. They're triggered. The masculine might be saying, if I had only gone to the Divine Feminine when I had a chance, we could have colored a, bit, a much better world, um, and that could totally set off the karmic at this point. Yeah. It's just a, it's just a mess now. This is just a mess. It's not even ridiculous anymore. It's redonkulous now. It is. Um, this person's someplace where they absolutely dread going, right? Very, very burdensome here. Very burdened. And now they've gone and gotten an STD from, from this karmic. And this karmic is flying off the handle. Freaking out because they're both fighting. They're trying to lie, right? They're trying to lie. There's holes in their story that, of course, your masculine at this point is seeing straight through. And all of this could be going on in front of the kids if there's, if there's children involved. If not, this is just a very fake individual here um, with possible mental issues. You know, yeah, fake individual, fake, fake, fake. I'm telling you, their story is fake. Um, your masculine, it, the light is being shed on this. Yep, it's time to move. What did I just say? It's, it. yeah, there's such a hurricane and so much. This is that perfect storm. Boom. I've been calling it out for months. And it's happening, guys. It's happening. Um, this is that perfect storm and your person is planning on moving or somebody is moving away here. Either the karmic or your, or your masculine. That's it. Too much turbulence, too much crap, too many lies. An STD that they cannot cure. That's gross, by the way. That's spreading. It's very emotional. That's it. I think this is your person saying, that's it. It's time for me to get out. Yeah. That's it. It's time to move. Yeah. Yeah. They were stung. They were backstabbed. They were betrayed. Yep. Stung, backstabbed, betrayed. The karmic's getting found out. Um, everything is crumbling here for this karmic now, okay? They can't really come back from this. They, they, yeah, your person, I feel like they know they were betrayed. This was like a, they just got stung. They chose wrong. They could have had it all with you. Um, and instead they chose someone where they, they stuck around. They got an STD. They got stung. Yep, and this is something that's permanent. Wow. 
Wow, this is this STD. What did I say? That it cannot be cured. They're trying to look it up, they're trying to find a cure, and they cannot. Well, this is permanent. This is permanent. They, it, there is no cure for this. They're really upset. Yeah, oh, they feel like a donkey's butt. Yeah, they feel foolish. That's how they feel, like a butt. They feel foolish. Yeah, yeah, they're saying to themselves, what a fool. What a fool. I could have had... I could have had it all with my divine feminine. I could have had it all with my divine feminine. But instead, I got a permanent sting. I'm feeling like a butt. Yep. I'm telling you guys. There's somebody out here that was that's finding out they've got an STD. The, uh, the storm's hitting, you know. People are getting their karma. It's that for, look, they're angry. They're closing the book on this. I'm telling you, it is done now. This is done. This is done. Your masculines, they're about to be alone, and this uh, this whole karmic situation is getting flushed down the toity. Yep, telling you. Yeah, this this masculine that they're angry, 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 angry. Uh, it's it's a done deal. The book is closed on this karmic situation. But this the sad part is is this masculine. They picked up something that that is incurable okay that's their karma for how they treated a divine feminine who would have given them everything yep wow well guys that's what i've got for this reading um i do hope this helps if you like this video, please click that like button, subscribe to my channel, help me grow, and until next time, person watching my collective, take care of you, and peace out.